Did you know that over 70% of online shopping carts are abandoned before purchase? Well, I mean, if you've got a WooCommerce store, this is a lot of potential revenue you may be missing out on. And that's exactly why in this video, I'll show you some of the most effective strategies to recover those abandoned carts and boost your sales. Okay, so my first tip might be a no brainer, but just hear me out. You have got to optimize your checkout experience. I mean, if your checkout process is really complicated, customers will just turn away. But the good news is you can make some really simple changes for high returns. For example, make your checkout process just one page long, which will minimize the number of steps people need to take to actually make the purchase. Now, the fewer pages they have to navigate through, the higher their engagement until the purchase is complete. Secondly, make sure to allow guest checkouts. Now, creating an account may be a total deal breaker for some customers, especially first time buyers. I mean, I know I've turned away from purchases because of this exact reason. And you can always send a post purchase invitation to create an account for future checkouts later. And finally, I strongly recommend you make sure your store's mobile checkout page is up to spec. I mean, a big portion of online shoppers buy stuff on their phones, so you need to make their experience as smooth as possible. Test the layout, button sizes as well, and overall usability on various devices to really ensure a seamless experience. So to summarize, refine the checkout process for a smoother path to purchase. This should improve your customer satisfaction and cart abandonment rates together with it. The next tip is a really big one, so listen up. If a customer notices that there are extra costs added at checkout that they weren't notified before, they click buy, they may leave right away. Address this by ensuring that all prices, taxes, fees, and any other additional costs are really transparent from the very beginning. Now, display these details prominently on product pages, in the cart, and at the checkout as well. And you can actually use a plugin like ACS Automatic Shipping Calculator to display fees and taxes based on the customer's location. And finally, a detailed FAQ section for a cost breakdown summary during checkout can help answer common questions and really build that trust in your store. And another way now to build trust is by making sure your store is as fast as possible and works without any hiccups whatsoever. That's where your hosting provider comes in. Your WooCommerce website may not show its true potential unless you've got a really reliable host whose services are optimized for what you do. Now for this, consider checking out Hostinger's WooCommerce hosting. It's really seamlessly integrated with the WooCommerce platform and is optimized for fast load times and a smooth shopping experience overall. This means fewer delays, better transactions, and happier customers. And if that sounds good to you, just click the link in the description below to check it out for yourself. And if you actually do decide to get this hosting, don't forget to use the coupon code WOO10 for 10% off your purchase. And speaking of making purchases, let's jump straight into my next tip to prevent cart abandonment. And by the way, did you know that 70% of customers consider the availability of their preferred payment method very or even extremely influential when choosing which online store to purchase from? I mean, that is a lot of customers losing interest because online stores don't offer a payment method they actually trust. And well, you don't want to make that mistake yourself. So to start, Make sure you provide standard options like credit and debit cards, of course, and then also integrate digital wallets such as PayPal, Google Pay, and Apple Pay. This will be especially really helpful when serving people who don't want to input their payment information manually. And also, you can check out this video right here if you want to learn even more about the best payment gateways and how to set them up in WooCommerce. I'll also leave uh, the link down below for this video in the description, so just make sure to check it out. Okay, so another really important thing to emphasize is the security of your store. I mean, nothing stops customers entering their payment details quicker than a shady and unsafe website. So make sure you've got an SSL certificate and feature trust badges on your checkout page. Got a trust pilot rating? Oh, great. Make sure to add it there as well because it can really help you out. 
And my last tip for today is to set up automatic cart abandonment emails. I mean, sometimes people just need a light nudge to buy something. That's what this method does. You'll remind the customer their shopping cart is ready and just they're waiting for them. I mean, you'll be surprised how effective this actually is. And tools like MailPoet and Cart Bounty make implementing this strategy easier and way more effective. With MailPoet, you can create personalized automated emails directly from your work press dashboard, which is super convenient. Now, Cart Bounty, on the other hand, tracks abandoned cart activity in real time and provides really valuable insight to tailor your recovery emails. You can set up a sequence of reminders for customers. I mean, send the first email within an hour of abandonment, for example, and then a second email after, let's say, 24 hours, and a final follow-up after a few days. And this can be really helpful for you as well. And when setting up the emails, make sure to address your customers by name. Also include images of the products they left behind and emphasize any extra benefits they'll receive. For example, these benefits can be incentives like discounts, free shipping, or limited time offers. And a message such as return to your card within 24 hours for free shipping can really provide the push people need. And finally, really ensure that your emails include a clear call to actions. Buttons or links should really direct customers straight back into their car to removing any extra steps and reducing any friction. And in addition to MailPoet and Car Bounty, you may also want to check out OmniSend and Retainful. All of these tools are really great for setting up cart recovery email campaigns and tracking the success of your efforts. So choose the one that best meets your needs and the one that you like best. And that's all I've got for you for today, guys. Make sure to implement these four tips and you will see your cart abandonment rates drop significantly. And also, if you've got any extra tips to help your fellow WooCommerce store owners, make sure to leave them down below in the comments section. And meanwhile, don't stop improving your WooCommerce website and its user experience. If you're wondering what you should do next, make sure to check out this video where I go over setting up product filters and guys, it's easier than you thought, trust me. And if you found the video helpful at all, drop us a like and also consider subscribing to Hosting Your Academy for more helpful videos just like this one in the future. Thank you so much for watching and I wish you all of the luck in your online store.